Hello, teachers, administrators, and district coordinators. My name is Mary McCarley, and I am the National Content Specialist with Goodhart Wilcox. In this presentation, I'll provide you a brief overview of the culinary professional, and we'll show you how to navigate the online platform. The Culinary Professional is aligned to the American Culinary Federation standards and the National Standards for Food Production and Services. It consists of five units, which introduce students to the food service industry, culinary fundamentals, ingredients preparation and presentation, the bake shop, and beyond cooking, which provides supplementary knowledge and skills necessary for a successful culinary career. There is in-depth coverage of relevant culinary topics, including knife skills, sustainability, analyzing cuisines, food presentation, and so much more. This text provides the knowledge students need for a career in the culinary arts and correlates to precision exam certification to prepare students to earn a career skills certificate in food service culinary arts. Each of the five units began by briefly describing fundamentals of food science. These spreads provide a brief explanation of the concept and how it relates to culinary success, along with questions to assess understanding. Units and chapters open with colorful images to grab student attention. Content is broken down into accessible chunks for easy comprehension. Every chapter includes a reading prep activity, culinary terminology, academic terminology, and learning objectives. Notice the activity icon next to culinary terminology. By clicking on it, this icon will take students to the companion website for an interactive learning experience as seen by the blue arrow. The Culinary Professional is written and designed to engage reader interest. Our textbook demonstrates key techniques and includes numerous food and equipment identification features to aid student learning. Other features focus on the culinary arts profession and occupations within the hospitality and tourism career cluster. For instance, this industry insights feature focuses on common interview questions, chef's ethic, Features focus on how students can remain ethical in the hospitality and tourism industry. Chef Speak features include tips from chefs for future culinary professionals to incorporate in their vocabulary. In addition, there is an entire chapter devoted to careers in the culinary, hospitality, and tourism industries. Additional features include sanitation and safety, hints from the chef, culinary trends, nutrition connection, and sustainable culinary. Features focusing on academic skills and cross-curricular instruction include mix in math, a serving of history, the science of flavor, science and technology, and culture and cuisine. Culture and cuisine talks about the role traditions and culture plays in different cuisines. We also have an entire chapter devoted to different world cuisines. Embedded within the pages of the book are recipes with step-by-step -step instructions so that students can apply what they have learned. Extensive chapter review materials reinforces learning and includes summary points, in review, core skills activities, which encourage students to apply writing, reading, speaking, listening, and math to chapter content while critical thinking challenges students to use higher level thinking. Additional review material includes technology, which explores technologies related to culinary arts, teamwork, which includes small group activities that encourages collaboration. Lastly, the chef's e-portfolio activities help students build portfolios for volunteer education and training or career opportunities. As I mentioned earlier, our textbook is interactive, allowing students to click on icons and go to the companion website, which offers a variety of activities such as video clips, animations, vocabulary games, matching games, 
e-flashcards, and more. All of these are easy to use and navigate and fun for students. The Student Lab Manual guides students through applying the key concepts of chapters. These pages can be printed or students can complete them digitally. The Student Study Guide contains activities that review culinary terminology and chapter content and further explore math applications in the workplace. Access the Video Clip Library, which provides dynamic visual instruction of essential culinary skills. This series reinforces methods taught in the culinary professional with video instruction led by industry recognized culinary experts, our textbook authors. Teachers, you will also have access to our extensive instructor resources to help you plan and facilitate your course. The Teacher's Edition and all the instructional material are found on the convenient online bookshelf and accessible at home, at school, or on the go. Support materials include detailed, ready-made lesson plans, ready-to-use editable PowerPoint presentations, and recipes. Teachers can also create customized chapter tests and unit exams using the ExamView software. Lastly, teachers will have access to textbook, lab manual, and study guide answer keys to make grading easier. These are the instructional resources for teachers in the online instructor resources. Teachers will have access to the student textbook, the companion website, lab manual, study guide, video clip library, and the online instructor resources. The student online platform will be very similar, but will not include the instructor resources. For those schools who choose to integrate with a learning management system, your online platform will appear differently than what you see on the screen, but the resources will be the same. Now let's take a look at the online platform. This is the online instructor resources for the culinary professional. I'll show you how to navigate the resources. First, let's start with the student textbook. The textbook is divided by units and by chapters. I'll click on chapter one. Welcome to the food service industry. On the left-hand side, you'll see a toolbar. The plus allows you to zoom in and see this page even closer. Minus, zoom out. The third button down or the contents button allows you to go to another unit or chapter of the book. Click again to close. The fourth button down or the resource tab allows you to go directly to the companion website. Remember, the companion website will house the interactive tools from within the pages of the book. Students can access them here, or they can find the activities icons within the pages of the book, hover over it, a blue rectangle or square will appear, and students can click directly on it. Click again to close. The last button down allows students and teachers to print pages of the textbook. This can be extremely helpful if you have a student with an IEP or a 504 who needs to mark a hard copy of the text. There are arrows on the left and the right that allow you to go to the next page of the book. We are on page six, so page six of the digital textbook will be the same as the page six of the hard copy of the textbook. You can jump to another page of the book by typing it in and clicking. You can also search our book by a key term and it will take you to all the pages of the book that include that key term and the key term will be highlighted as well. This was a brief overview of our online platform for the student textbook. I clicked the My Bookshelf tab to take me back to the main landing page. Next, the companion website. You can access the companion website from the main landing page you can also access the companion website from within the pages of the textbook or the toolbar. I'll click on it from the main landing page. The companion website is divided by chapters. 
I encourage you to explore these interactive tools. Next, let's look at the student lab manual. The lab manual is also divided by units and by chapters. I'll click on chapter seven. On the left-hand side, you'll see that familiar toolbar. This time, the fourth button down or the resource tab is going to allow you to see the lab manual with form fields so that students can type directly into the form fields. I'll click on chapter four. As you can see, students can type directly in and then submit digitally. I'll click the My Bookshelf tab in the top left corner to take me back to the main landing page. Next, the study guide. The study guide is also divided by units and by chapters. This time, I'll click on chapter one. You'll see that familiar toolbar. The fourth button down or the resource tab is going to allow you to see the study guide with form fields. Now, students can type directly into the form fields and then submit digitally. I'll click the My Bookshelf tab to take me back to the main landing page. Next, the video clip library. Here, you'll be able to access the 62 video clips that provide dynamic visual instruction of essential culinary skills. I strongly encourage you to check out these videos. Next, let's look at what's available for teachers in our online instructor resources. Click again, instructor resources. I'll minimize this gray tab so that you can see the three gray tabs you have available to you. First, introductory materials. Here, you'll find some information on best practices, assessments, portfolio rubrics, and information related to the FCCLA and Skills USA event preparation and correlations. Also, you'll see an additional correlation to the National Standards for Food Preparation and Services. I'll minimize this gray tab. Chapter resources. Teachers, this is where you'll go most often to help plan and facilitate your course. I'll click on chapter two textbook answer keys, annotated study guide, lesson plan, and PowerPoint presentation. If I click on another chapter, you'll see that the format is the same. I'll minimize this gray tab. Lastly, assessment software and question pool. This is the software that is needed for teachers to create and customize exams for students. Now is the time to update your curriculum. We offer print resources, digital resources, and bundle for those districts who prefer print and digital resources for students. We integrate with learning management systems, offer rostering implementation options, and teachers can post to other platforms such as Google Classroom and Microsoft Teams. We offer easy, quick implementation, training, professional development, and ongoing support. If you do not already have access to our online platform, first, contact your GW Educational Consultant today. Second, schedule a 60-day free preview and try the resources in your own classroom. Third, choose GW, select implementation and training dates, and you are ready to get started. Let's work together to build careers.